Hello everyone and welcome to a brand new mini game that I've just created today and it is called Spawner Safari Battles. Now the general idea here is you have several spawners set up and they have every Pokemon in the game in them. And you have a 60 second time limit once you start to catch anything you see. So the uh, levels are set up from 1 to 100. So you're going to want to get one friend or a couple friends and you each get six master balls to start with and then you get 60 seconds once the spawners turn on to catch anything you can <laughs> so don't waste your master balls you only get six so catch the six best pokemon you find and then afterwards you battle each other so i'm just going to give you a quick little demonstration of how that goes so keep watching all right so there's probably a better way to do this but i'm going to turn on my four spawners by hand really quick and things are going to start spawning immediately okay so we have 60 seconds from now to catch the six strongest things we see so level 88 execute that's pretty good literally any Pokemon can spawn and they can be any level so yeah you've got to keep your eyes open good Pokemon can spawn that are low level and bad Pokemon can spawn that are high level so gotta watch everything I've got an execute wheezing and whatever that other thing I just got was Celio uh ooh, level 94 Solosis oh I missed and hit a level 18 Celio <laughs> that is also a danger another execute level 97 all right well that's all my Pokemon We've got 15 seconds left, so I'll make sure uh, my friend here gets all the time he has. He might be done as well. Okay, so we've got 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, and stop. Okay, so now I'm going to turn all the spawners off. And just make sure everyone stops exactly on 60 seconds, because if they go over that, they are cheating. <laughs> It's supposed to be a really time-constrained thing, so you have to think on your feet and go fast, and just catch all the good stuff immediately. Okay, so, then you want to come over here. I guess you won't have the same map if you make this as well, but... Then you want to go into a arena, and let's grab my other execute. <laughs> Two executes, that's awesome. One's level 97, though, so that's really good. I always have problems with catching things that... I wasn't aiming at, so let's just send out this bad Celio first. Okay, level 18 Celio gonna start us off. Ice Ball, I don't even know what move that is. He's got a level 84 Pile of Swine? Uh, let's see. Pile of Swine's good against a lot of stuff here. Let's go into Solosis, level 94. <laughs> oh, we have uh, Rollout, Psychic, and Recover, this could be good. Ooh, wow, that Psychic did a lot. Let's uh, just recover. That was a good play. He got a crit there. <laughs> there we go. Killed the Pile of Swine. Zoroark. Let's go into... Uh... Let's go into the other Celio. Oh, wow. He gets another crit. He's so lucky. I'm gonna try to Swagger. Got him. And then let's Ice Ball. <laughs> Hit himself in confusion. Let's snore now, too. <laughs> I think I got him. Let's ice ball. <laughs> he says hacks. I say awesome. Okay, uh, poison gas. We poisoned him. Alright, uh, we can use Explosion. I don't like this Zoroark because I have like three Psychic Pokemon. Let's try to Explosion. I think he's going to kill us. Yeah. Okay, let's go into Bad Execute. And, uh, let's Bullet Seed here. Hopefully he can't kill us in one shot. He cannot. Wow. This is not good. I hope we're faster than Zoroark. Just hit a roll out. Really? Okay, well he died. Now we have level 97 execute, that's all we have left. Okay, Dodrio, that's not good at all. 
Worry Seed. I don't even know what that does. Let's go with an extra sensory. Well, that looks like that's that. <laughs> well, GG. <laughs> he still had a Blaziken, a Sharpedo, a Grimer. Alright, but that's the tutorial, guys. If you want to set it up, it's pretty simple. Just uh, set up some spawners that have every single Pokemon in them. That takes a while to set up, but yeah. Make the uh, really good Pokemon harder to spawn. I have uh, 25 rarity for the common stuff and one rarity for the rare stuff. You can vary that up however you want. Then one min level, 100 max level. I've got uh, the max number of spawns at 25, spawn radius 11. The spawn radius really just depends in the, on the area you want them to spawn in. And then bosses you want off obviously and you want everything spawning on passive. So, you might be able to put every Pokemon on one spawner, I haven't really tried that, I just went with four to make sure everything could fit. But yeah guys, that is the tutorial for spawner safari battles, so if you want to try that out yourself, get a friend or a few friends and go for it. So, thanks for watching, and I hope you have fun.